Hi everyone, uh, my name is Bharti, I'm from Chakra Innovation. And before I begin the story of what we do, I would like all of you to look at this picture that you see here, which says breathe. This breathe is not written with normal black paint. It is written with pollution and smoke that we were able to capture in India. So I would like to tell you more about how we are helping people breathe. As you might know, air pollution is one of the leading causes of deaths across the globe. It causes cardiovascular diseases, it causes respiratory diseases, it causes cancer, and it causes irreversible lung damages to the lungs of children all across the globe. Unfortunately, there aren't many effective technologies that are available out there to control the polluting sources. So looking at this, we decided to develop something that can control pollution at source and stop it from going out into the air. So we have a technology that takes pollution at source, captures more than 90% of smoke that is coming out of it, and it is able to do so without consuming a lot of energy. So we consume only 1% of the energy to capture this pollution without causing any adverse impact on the engine. It's a retrofit device, so it's scalable, and that's not all. We are able to take this pollution and convert it into something useful. So right here with me, I have a bottle that has pollution trapped in it. So it's one of the largest killers of the world trapped in a bottle and it can be put to use like textile printing, cardboard printing, etc. We've been selling this technology to a lot of industries in India. We've had traction, we've been running the device for almost a year across 30 locations in India. We've already um, received around 70k euros worth of sale and we're looking at 170k in this year. We also have good margins on the product, so we plan to scale up the technology and take it further. To take it further, we've also partnered with some of the largest industries in India. So we have a large oil and gas company that is helping us develop it for their boilers and their generators. We have Bosch, which is a German company, helping us refine this technology further and make it more effective. We've also been awarded. Uh, so we were a part of the Echoing Green Fellowship and also a part of the Forbes 30 Under 30 for social entrepreneurship. And we have a team of young, enthusiastic engineers. But it's not just the young blood which gets things done. We have, a, we have a support from experienced people in the industry with more than 30 years of experience who are helping us take this technology further. What we're looking for from Slush is not just investors, but also networking and helping us grow this technology and further. And with that, we have to end. Thank you so Thank much, Bharti. Let's see what the jury thinks. Sure. Um, I, think, I think this sounds uh, super cool. It's both reducing pollution and making um, uh, products out of it. So I'm wondering why then are you aiming for 70K and 170K uh, with such an amazing product? I mean, uh, so, uh, so we, for the last one year, we were working on refining the product, and we've only been uh, selling it properly for this year. Uh, so right now, we have a small production setup, and we obviously need money to scale up that production. So our constraint is not on the demand side right now. We have demand, but we want to set up the supply uh, large enough. So right now, with the money that we have, we have a small production facility, but we want to scale it up further. Maybe I missed it, but can you really like briefly reflect on the technology? So how do you produce the product? And is the product harmful? How do you actually secure safety of that product? Sure. Uh, so the technology to capture um, is, again, a, 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 a technology that we've applied a patent for. It has a heat exchanger that cools the smoke that is coming out and a solvent that continuously circulates, which captures the pollution. Um, th there is uh, innovation in the design as well as the process in which we are capturing it. It is made out of stainless steel, so the only harm that we do is what happens while stainless steel is being produced. The ink that we have, which gets captured in the solvent, is absolutely safe to use. So we have it tested for heavy metal and carcinogens. There's nothing like that in it. The carcinogenic nature comes when it's in the air and it goes into your lungs, but not when it's in a binder. Thank you for an amazing presentation. And um, I must say that's very unique. And I like the fact that you are working with corporates in industry like oil and gas, and you mentioned some companies. What is your future 
deployment plan when it comes to other corporates or other industries? Do you have any other clients in line that you would like to work with? Sure. So currently, uh, the product that we have is for stationary diesel generators and for small scale boilers that are used in the industry. But we want to scale it up and use it for larger industries as well, which have furnaces and chimneys that are burning biomass so that we can capture uh, pollution from there as well. We're mostly targeting B2B because we believe that industries need to become a lot more sustainable and people are already doing a lot. So that's the broad idea. Yeah. And can you apply the product also like domestically to, to local like heaters or is it only like designed for big industry facilities? So um, at least in India and the developing countries, there are very few domestic polluting sources except for firewood and cook stoves, but they're also being replaced. So we're not really focusing on the domestic industry right now. Uh, we might consider it, but not, not in our focus right now. Much. And I'm curious about your expansion. Are you currently just focused on India or would you like to go into other markets? So we want to go into other markets. In fact, we've been looking at the European and the US market as well, where there are very strict norms and the current technologies are either very costly or consume a lot of energy. So we believe there is a huge market for us out there and we are looking for people who can help us expand into other countries as well as Africa and other Southeast Asian countries. Thank you so much. Are there any competitors doing the same or similar things out there? So uh, in terms of controlling pollution from industrial sources, there are certain technologies available, but they're not as effective. Um, in terms of making ink out of pollution, there is one competitor in India. They're doing this with vehicles. So they're taking the exhaust from vehicles and converting into inks and paints. Thank you. All right. Thank you so much. All the way from India. Barty and Chakra, thank, thank you so much.